Wes Phillips here at the Small HD booth at NAB 2017. Uh, we've got some pretty exciting products. Uh, a couple months ago, we launched our Ultra Bright lineup, starting with our 503 and our 703 Ultra Bright. They are ultra bright. They're, they're over 2,000 nits each. This one is 2,200, and the seven inch version is 2,500 nits. Those are the brightest monitors in those sizes, and we're out doors demonstrating how bright they really are in this kind of lighting condition, and you can actually uh, assess mid-tone and even shadow detail even in really bright conditions like that. Um, they are higher-end products at uh, $2,500 and $3,000 respectively, um, but they offer a, a significant upgrade of features and also some new uh, function buttons that we've added to our, our standard interface that allow you to assign not only functions but assign uh, pages within our pages menu system so that you can swap between pages of functions very quickly and easily. Um, they'll also do uh, a two-up view of the screen, so you can have two inputs going in, um, whether it's two SDIs or an SDI and an HDMI, and you can see both those at the same time, or you can actually compare input one with a, another version of input one, like if you have a LUT applied and you want to see the, the comparison. Uh, so that's really handy on these two. Um, on the heels of this, we've actually launched a really affordable daylight viewable display. This is called the Focus. It's um, a 5-inch display that has 800 nits. Um, again, for $500, it comes with the monitor uh, that happens to be a touchscreen display, sort of our first foray into true touchscreen, and, uh, and this bracket, this tilt bracket, because usually you end up with some really garbage ball mount that doesn't work very well, and we wanted to provide a much improved user experience by, uh, by including this uh, tilt mount. It has all the same features that our other monitors have, high, high definition waveforms, uh, the whole pages system, the ability to load LUTs via SD card, um, and uh, yeah, it's, it's, it's a very fully featured product. It also has a kind of a neat party piece, especially for um, on cameras like this Sony a7. Um, when you load a, uh, a, a Sony L series battery on the back of it, which obviously it can go up to about 45 watt hours depending on what size you have, um, you can pull power from the battery through the monitor down into the camera via a battery eliminator. Um, and that will drive the camera for longer than you would get out of the camera's battery normally. So a camera like this recording 4K is probably going to last about an hour. Uh, this all together with one big battery on the back can run for two and a half hours straight because uh, this product only draws six watts. Um, so again, very power efficient even though it's bright. Same could be said for this. These are you know, uh, almost three times as bright as this product and um, this one only draws 13 watts which is very, very low compared to competition. Um, so these are some pretty exciting new uh, products. Um, something not so bright, but very colorful and color accurate is our new 702 OLED. Um, we're really excited about that product because it's, it's kind of the first on-camera monitor that gets its own calibration LUT uh, created using a K10 uh, Klein probe and Calman software um, at the factory before it gets shipped out. And uh, it's very color accurate to Rec. 709. It provides beautiful colors and high contrast and would be a great uh, monitor to judge color on. It also features the uh, button system that we've applied to the ultra brights for being able to uh, assign pages or features like waveform or uh, brightness and all those different kinds of things. So uh, it's a, uh, but it's it's actually a, a pretty affordable monitor at uh, sixteen hundred dollars uh, U.S. And uh, the ultra brights are shipping now. They're on back order because they're pretty popular, but um, that should. Uh, uh, in soon, and the um, the 702 OLED is in stock shipping now. The uh, the Focus is uh, shipping in June, and again, its price point uh, starts at $500. Um, and again, ships with the bracket and and some cables. Um, so these are uh, the new products we have at Small HD. Uh, and uh, thanks for coming by. If you want more information, go to www.smallhd.com.